past has been a pleasure, hasn't it? But it's been great to see. I mean, you just get that little bit of imagination from one or two players, and like we're seeing now. Right back, Selwyn Cambo, and brilliant. Here's Alex Kiwomia. Couple in the middle. Oh, Kiwomia's gone for goal and nearly found him. Well, I think Ben Amos in the end has done quite well because I think he's expecting a cross. And I think Alex might have been expecting I th a cross. I think Alex was trying to put the cross in, but he's got it too close to the goalkeeper. Simon Cambo does really well, doesn't he? he? Creates a good bit of space for Kiwomia. And Kiwomia does the right thing, puts it in quite early, which is what the, defend uh, the attackers were looking for, the likes of Izzy Brown. But I'm not too sure that he was probably going for the cross there. Comes the corner, great chance, oh, Izzy Brown, side foot volley. Perfect for him, wasn't it? Absolutely perfect. Scorer. Nothing else, and I don't necessarily mean that in a bad way, but that's what he does. And Brown certainly has wonderful creativity. He passes as well as anyone on this side. It's Petrucci. Brown sliding in, helping his side win the ball back. And he's got it again here, Izzy Brown. Reese Mitchell's in the middle, deflection, and that's actually a pretty good save from Amos. Well, he's being worked, isn't he, the goalkeeper? And again, great running. Number six on his back tonight, which would usually denote the, the deeper lying role, but him and Baker are probably going to alternate that tonight. And Swift again, good first touch, and second, gets it back from Brown, and gives it back to Brown. Lovely move. Corner. It took a nick on the way through. He's done well there, is he? You know, he's, up, he's un yeah, great football. He didn't quite have enough space when he received the pass. He's being closed down very, very quickly. But quick for him to do. He's barely had a touch, Ben, which is good for the back four. You know, that's uh, a pat on the back for them so far. Long way to go, of course, but keep it. Go good to see them uh, working so hard. We saw a lot of work going in with the front line. Alex Kouamio and Izzy Brown. Midfield pushing him well, and we've won the ball again. Look at Kouamio go. A hole that no one else could run through, but Alex Kiwomi managed to. Fisted in there towards Izzy Brown, well gathered by Amos. He's in England under 21. Or not. Plan is at the moment, although it could yet change, that at the end of the year the top 11 are going to be the, the top flight, if you like. Next season, and the bottom 11 will be the, a sort of second tier. Here comes Aki up from the back. Oh, dangerous ball into Brown! Oh, Kiwomi has missed it first time around. And it's only a corner, it should have been a Chelsea goal. What a chance, what a chance for Alex Kawamia. Nathan Aki does it ever so well. Initially, though, in the build-up, there was a little reverse pass by Jeremy Boga. Or was it Reese Mitchell? Just flicked it round the corner. Lewis Baker gets onto it, threaded ball, lovely delivery in by Aki. And Alex Kawamia misses his shot from six yards, Ben. Nathan does well here, this is a super ball in. He should be scoring. And the one thing is about Alex Corby, he is a goal scorer. We know he normally scores goals, but not on his left foot there. He's been very, very short in the league. He's, has been worked on. Down at Cobham, they all have their little individualised plans of things they have to study and things they have to improve on. Very technical. There's Kumomia. Plenty of shirts for forward. Kumomia has curled a rather aimless one wide in the end. Yeah, I think he got himself into two minds there, Alex. I think he's in. He was badly hurt there, got up fairly quickly. The advantage was played by very Jonathan Hunt there. Bit of a tangle. So when Cambo comes out best from it. Hot potato at the moment, isn't it? No one can get hold of it. Maybe Kumomia now. Off he goes, you're not going to catch him, how's the cross? Oh, dangerous into Izzy Brown, solid connection, good chance, but another chance that goes begging for... Play. They've got a lot of players back behind the ball then. And that's helped them out, and it stopped us from scoring, but it just gives them nothing going forward. And I think they've been pretty poor, United, when they've got an attacking sense. It's John Swift, going for goal, didn't find the power. Given. But it's a, I think it's a good decision by the referee, you know, because he's he's waiting for contact. And we often say, don't we? Players think that just because there's contact, they can they can uh, they can get the free kick just because they go down. And I think Jeremy's done really well there to, to stand his ground, work hard to get back in there. Chance for Izzy Brown here. It's Aki trying to squeeze through. Amos came out and it's cleared just before it could go anywhere else.
have been heading wide anyway, but Akangamani didn't know it. Nathan Aki was the shot. Who knows what the plans were upstairs, but had he been fully fit and firing and playing well, Nemanja Matic might not have been signed. Absolutely. Or maybe not signed until the summer. Or what a revelation he's been. Well, exactly. It's, uh, quality in the middle of the park. For future and maybe for the present there for Chelsea, of course. Kalesian has moved on in that department. Frank Lampard is uh, not young. Here's Aki. Flag is up. He must make the save anyway. Aki's done a lot of getting up from left back, hasn't he? He has, as I said, he, he just continues his run. He's unlucky here. I think let's get to the side and you see the little inside run from Izzy Branch. It was the reverse pass, doesn't quite come off, but contestant. Well done, Jeremy Boger there as well. Working hard to win the ball back. Chance here, great chance. Lewis Baker hit it straight at Ben Amos. Brilliant by Jeremy Boger. His balance is. And Alex Davy gets back into position after going to ground. Does really well. Christensen holds him up and gives Alex a chance to get back into position and pinch the ball. And they've made it look so simple. Two centre backs working well together. Here goes Kiwamia. Look at the speed. Alex Kiwamia, it's opened up for him. Wonderful chance and an equally wonderful block. Well, I think he's done the right thing, Ben. I don't think you can pass when you get into that position. It's a deep one. Aki back into the mix. Almost dropped for Van Hinkle for a second there, the loose ball. I just want a little bit of luck, thank you. That's a great ball by Mitchell Beanie. And the tick <laughs> was as bad, was it, from Baker? Van Hinkle's shot, oh, almost a perfect comeback. Little nick on the way through, which made the save from Ben Amos even better, to be fair to him. Oh, just, just under the 12 minutes to go, and just feel again we're just up in the tempo a little bit. It always happens when you get decent deliveries into the box, you get teams slightly on the back foot, and I think we've got United on the back foot here. Maybe there's going to be a chance for us before the final whistle. Swift. Nice ball. Kiwomia! Oh, flags up anyway. He's pulled it wide. It set up nicely for the volley, didn't it? But it's made a good run across the line. And again, when you're just vying for that into those positions, we know with law of averages with Alex, he'll score. You should tell him it's the uh, UAP youth league. Over half his goals in that competition. So when Cambo, another strong run, he was taken out, but play will go on. Advantage, John Swift. It's a shame because I think he, John Swift thought that Simon Cambo had gone to ground there, but just manages to stay, and that was a better pass. Baker, all deflection. Let's have a Chelsea back, I think, this one. Again, good to see the lads. If they need to. It just seems un unhurried, which you want in your central midfielders, don't you? It's something Absolutely. Absolutely. long been decried about young English midfielders is that they're, they're not comfortable on the ball in tight pressure situations like you know Spanish ones and Dutch ones supposedly are, are better at it but really good to see well it is and Lewis Baker typifies that but this is a good break as well Kiwomia is onside this time Swift is in the middle Van Hinkle has his hand up and Izzy Brown is kind of got underneath it really it's a shame yeah, and again, Alex Kawamia gets into a good position. You can see Dermot as well there, wave his centre-backs forward. Obviously, with the last minute of the game, you want to get every advantage you can and pull a free kick deep. It's not normally how we play, but get it in the box. And it comes from Baker. Oh, what a chance! Brown was there again. Van Hinkle as well at the far post beyond Izzy Brown. I think he thought Izzy was going to head this. There's a chance, isn't it? Lewis Baker's put this just where you want it in the mix. Izzy can't quite get up to head it, but... Van Hinkle must have thought that Izzy was going to play this. It's a chance. Wouldn't that have been in a fairy tale, right? Lewis Baker, I just think if it would have been Izzy Brown or Alex Kawamia, probably might have got on the end of that ball. In the end, at least a, a clean sheet, Ben. It's always, always a good thing for Dermot. He'd be pleased with that. But it is that rarest of events for Dermot.
and his under 21s a goalless draw the first one of the season it might easily not have been it probably shouldn't have been and but for Ben Amos I think it wouldn't have been the chances were all Chelsea's